I'm back to show you a few tricks with the Zoom tool. The Zoom tool can be accessed by clicking on the icon the top right of your toolbox or by pressing Z. There's several options for the Zoom tool. You can either zoom in, which is the default, click minus and then zoom out. You can select a zoom level by either typing in the box or dragging this little slider. You can use resize windows to fit if you've got your windows floating within Photoshop elements. I tend not to use floating windows so I don't use that option very often. You can zoom on all windows if you've got a couple of windows showing at once it will zoom both windows the same amount. Now it won't take them to the same zoom level it'll just zoom them both in and out as you click on it. One to one gives you one pixel on screen for one pixel in your image so it zooms in quite far. Fit screen fits your whole document or layout to the screen. Fill screen fills the width of your screen with your layout and print size estimates the print size of your layout. It's not super accurate. For me I like to get a ruler and then just zoom in until it's accurate. But it changes depending on your screen size, your file resolution and lots of things like that. So it estimates 24% but in my calculations it's around 30% for this layout. Now another thing you can do with your zoom tool is click and drag and that will allow you to zoom in on just the selected spot. So if I want to zoom in on that stitch I can just zoom, click and drag on the stitch and it'll fill my whole screen. If I want to just work on the journaling, click and drag on the journaling area and there we have it. If you hold down Alt, you'll change between zooming in and out. So if I've selected zoom out and I hold down Alt, it'll change to zoom in. If I click on zoom in, which is the default, and then hold down Alt, it'll zoom out. So that can be quite easy. To, if you've zoomed in a little too far, just zoom out a bit. Now at any time you may like to use the hand tool to move around your layer. It can be easier than using the scroll bar sometimes. A short cut way to get to the hand tool is just hold down the space bar. And you can do that where you've got any tool selected. A couple of other tips for your zoom is Control plus will zoom in and Control minus on your keyboard will zoom out. Control zero will make the whole layout fit on your screen. So there you have it. A few tips on how to use your zoom tool. Would you like to see more Photoshop Elements video tutorials? Visit digitalscrapbookinghq.com for more tips, tutorials and free online workshops.